After being scammed out of thousands of dollars, people are pitching in to help a Lexington veteran whose home had fallen into disrepair. As Joe Ducey reports, a Lexington police officer is the one who made it all happen. It looks more like a construction site than a home on a residential block in Lexington. We're out here cleaning up Mr. Sykes' house. Um, I saw the story on the news yesterday and it touched me, so I felt like I needed to come out and help. Dozens of people converged on the 900 block of DePores Avenue to help make over a home that had fallen into an almost unlivable state. For over three years, just, he's been given his money thinking he was helping someone else pay for their chemotherapy when really he was being scammed out of money and suffering himself trying to help someone else. Ryan Holland is a Lexington police officer. He was working on a different project a few houses down. Kind of walked through the neighborhood looking for another place to help and didn't have to walk far. Five houses down and found Mr. Sykes was in dire need of help. People of all ages pitched in using everything from rakes to excavators. <laughs> We pulled off the, the roof yesterday. There was four raccoons. Basically, this house needs to be redone. All this furniture is no good anymore. There's so much water damage and mold and things like that. Those lending a hand say it's inspiring to see so many people rallying around a veteran in need. This world is so, so disjointed these days. There's so much hate. There's just nobody pulls together so this is just a sign that it can be done going on for three years if i can if i can walk down one street in lexington and find two families that are in need of help and that's the problem people need to get out of their houses talk to each other learn how to love each other again covering the news in lexington joe ducey lex 18 news sports is up next